Hey, what's up, everybody? Thanks for clicking on the video. This is David Pendleton, and this is it, hole number nine of the Open Nine Hole Cup Tournament Rookie Division. I really hope you hit a lot of perfect balls and these shots went in for you. Lots of drops here in this particular nine hole cup, so definitely very winnable. All right, let's check out hole number nine. I just played this one for the Eagle. Both shots at 0% max. That means the drive and shot number two, 0%. Two bars a side spin to the left, about two and a half bars a top spin. You see here, we make our wind adjustment, like I said, 0% at max. We're going to use just a little bit of curl until the left side of my ball is touching the inner wall of the blue adjustment zone. Just a little bit of baby curl, not too much. Don't go crazy with it. So all we're trying to do is just get the ball right up here. And then shot number two with our big dog will be easy to get to the green. A couple of different ways your big dog ball guideline will, or, will look. Uh, if you get a little bit shorter distance on your drive like I did, the rough bump rollout is the best way to do it. Two bars of side spin to the left combined with enough top spin to get that second bounce in the rough just like this with your ball guideline rolling onto the fairway, okay? If you get more yards on the drive, you'll be able to play it over the rough and try to attack the pin. Never easy to pick up an albatross with a big dog, but it's there. For players who want to spin up and go with higher power balls, you could put yourself in a position um, to where you could take a sniper shot and try to pick up this alba. But for me, just played it safe. Didn't want to spend a ton of practice tokens trying to go for that shot because it's going to be really difficult anyways. Chip in for the Eagle. Call it a day. I'll see you all next week for the major tournament. Thanks for your support, everybody. Hit the thumbs up and let me know how you finished at least.